Hello everyone, this is Lon Sargo Katumba from LSK Academy and today I'm going to show you how you can tuck in and squeeze with a 4-3-3 formation with the midfielders so you can cut away option of the player playing forward so you have my center back 4 and 5 and my full backs are in the black so all they do is keep the ball, 2 touches for the blue, uh, for the teams that are outside so r right now it's a blue team so they have 2 touches, the black is neutral, they just keep the ball, knock it knock it knock it and the red team just squeezes in to cover for you know for their team for their center backs it's simple as that they just cover him covering knock it once the red wins it like right here as you see right here they can make that pass to their team and then the red the team the red on the other side keeps it and the blacks which are neutral they squeeze they slide over and now they're you know they're playing for the red team and they just still knock it so it's all about squeezing in for the defenders, this crew is working on, on on the midfielders so that they can squeeze in and tuck in and take away options, take away space, so that it's hard for the other team to pass through them, so that it's hard for the other team to to make those diagonal pass and make those passes to the forward. So this is the idea: is you take away options. You see right here, number four. They squeezed him. They squeezed him so much that he he has no option but to play back. Same thing with the number five. They take away his option so that the only pass he has is to play to a number four. And then right then, you can go, you can win it. As number 10 just did right there. He won it. Because the only option the number five had is to play that ball to him. And it's easy to win it back. So once you win it back, you can transit and play it on the other side. So you play your teammates on the other side. And now it's your ball. So same thing right here. The black slide over. And now they're playing for the blue team again. And they still knock it. You know, simple. Knock it keep the ball simple just keeping it two touches keeping it so that it's all about patient patience just be patient be patient the ball will come to you you don't overwork don't overwork yourself let the ball do the work same thing right here